welcome to my channel if you are new here yes join take a seat there's plenty of seats there's some in the back have a seat get comfortable okay so as you can see by the title i will be talking about my favorite stylers for this year 2021 um including creams and gels let's get into it Alright, so first we have the Texture ID Styling Cream. Now, I feel like everybody knows what this cream is because of African Beauty because she really hyped it up. So I went out to go buy it because she was like, this is the truth. I was like, okay, fine. And it's, it's really good, okay? It's so good. It's super thick. So if your hair likes thick products, then I feel like this will be really good for you. It's also very moisturizing. But the only reason why this is not a 10 out of 10 for me is because it doesn't really clump my curls the way that i like it so that's why it's giving a seven <laughs> i have my reasons but i just feel like it, if it was like a little bit better in clumping then this would definitely be a 10 but if you are looking for a, a product that's thick and moisturizes your hair for a good amount of time in between wash days then i recommend this so the next product we have is from african pride this is their moisture miracle shea butter and flaxseed oil moisturize and fine curling cream okay handful in the mouth but that is what it is it comes in 12 ounces so you're getting a lot here it, it says moisturize and define curling cream but i think it's more so moisturizing because defining and eh. but the moisture babes moisture yes if you're doing a long-term protective style and you want something to just moisturize your hair the curling cream okay i'm always tell you the curling cream because moisture on 10 so i give this a 10 out of 10 honestly my fave i'm running out i need to get more also pricing i got this for seven dollars i don't remember where local beauty supply maybe i would say yes it, you get your money's worth for this so next we have talia waheed it is the curly curl cream now i had a little oops with this product so i wanted to get this product for black friday and i was shopping on the talia waheed website and it was like this on the website eight fluent ounces i'm like oh i think i want a little bit more and i got this this is like a pump you know i like the pump pump is nice pump is cool i don't mind the pump the problem is these are not the same thing i was getting this thinking that it was this this is not this okay so this is the curly cream creamy hair lotion this is what I got thinking that it was this because I thought it was like a different type of application thing. I like this way better than this. So if you get this, just know it's not this. Just letting you know. But anyway, back to who I'm talking about. This is the Curly Curl Cream. It says extreme curl definition, no buildup or frizz, moisturizes and conditions hair with shea butter and sage. It's also paraben free. It's a six fluent ounce container this is also why i was getting this because this is eight fluent ounces i thought i was getting more whatever i got this for eight dollars at my local beauty supply i was like eight dollars for six fluent ounces mm. but then i smelled it child when i tell you you will fall in love with this smell it smells so good so good i'm not even like playing when i tell you this i recently used this like two weeks ago and i loved it i used it for the twist um kept it really moisturized i had no flakes it was doing its job okay but if i had to give this a rating i would give it i would give an a because the application was kind of weird for me i think it was just me though i think it was me user error so i'm gonna use this again in the future but it's an eight for now all right, next we have another product from Talia Waheed. It is the Shea Coco Natural Hair Moisturize Detangling and Styling Cream. I bought this product for Black Friday. She shocked the hell out of me, okay? That's what I'm gonna say. I bought this, you know, trying to fill up my cart to get the deal, whatever deal they were doing at the time and didn't really think nothing of it. This product is extremely thick she ain't coming out this job okay she's not no matter how many times i dangle she's not and that's what i love about it it's super thick my hair loves thick products 
like I don't like what what product do you know do this <laughs> it's so thick oh my god so yeah this product is extremely moisturizing and I know you're noticing a trend all these creamers creamers for all these creams I've said that it's moisturizing which is why it's my favorite and it's true my hair struggles to stay moisturized for a long period of time and I like to buy stylers that cater towards moisture so my hair is not dry for like a week and a half you know it's not gonna help my hair growth so yeah this product is amazing it comes in eight fluid ounces but it's literally packed to the top <laughs> I don't even it's packed to the top you get all eight I wasn't missing not one ounce like you get all eight ounces not even playing for the price I'll put it somewhere on the screen and for the other ones too before because I'm pretty sure I forgot to mention the price but I really do love this I love the size I love the application of this I love how it moisturized and not only moisturized but it defined my hair when I used it and that's what I love a styler that moisturizes defines and does what it needs to do for the week so yeah this rating 10 out of 10 no questions asked and for the very last cream styler that i have it is none other than talia wahid okay for the win was i saying wahid it's wajid it's wajid i'm so sorry how am i gonna love this product and not know the woman's name <laughs> oh my god jeez okay talia wajid i'm so sorry talia i'm so sorry i know it says for children don't let it trip you up, honestly. And because it's for children, it costs a little bit less, which is fine with me in my in my pockets. I recommend. Oh, this is empty. This is empty. This is empty. There's nothing in here. But just know, it, it, there's a reason why it's empty. I scraped this thing to the nub. I didn't leave no. There's no product in here. I scooped it till all of it was gone because I'm not gonna waste this goodness in the bottle <laughs> you tripping this is the first styler that i fell in love with and i still love her first of all the product take a guess it's thick and moisturizing and defines honestly love this hair product it's formula what it does to my hair it makes it shiny moisturized defines it makes it last long in between wash days i can last more than a week with this styler in my head and i got this it says for seven dollars which honestly is not that bad for this type of product for her brand because she fills it to the top and her stuff is actually good so i don't mind paying seven dollars for this and i don't see a lot of people talking about talia yg's other products like all i hear is the apple and aloe line and then the pre-shampoo like she has other things that are amazing for type 4 hair and i'm just trying to put y'all on all right for my favorite gels we got the OG, okay? The OG. This thing is as big as my head. Nope, my head's bigger. This is the Eco Style Black Caster and Flaxseed Gel. This was all over the internet. I tried it, got my hands on it. It was amazing. I love this gel. Some of my favorite creams to like pair this with is the Style and Shine from Talia Wahid that I mentioned earlier. I feel like these two are really good. It's already clumps my curls really well, but this like seals the deal and it keeps it moisturized. So I really like these two together. Okay, so the next gel is also from Eco. It is a Cannabis Sativa Oil Black Castor Oil and Olive Oil Gel. This is what it looks like. It's kind of empty. I like this gel a lot. I feel like it really does clump my curls really nicely. I don't use this gel by itself. Actually, all the gels that I mentioned, I don't use by itself. I like to mix it with a cream. So I found that my best results were when I used the Style and Shine. Now, I know this seems like I'm using this with everything and not the others, but there was a point in time where I didn't have those and this is all I had and this is all that I could mix. So I have yet to try a gel with any one of those other stylers that I mentioned, but I find these but I find these two together, it's actually my holy grail. I love to reach for these two when I do a style. I'm starting to venture out more into other things. I'm not using the same thing every time because I do have a lot of other products. So yeah, these two, 
amazing so the next one we have is the aunt jackie's don't shrink black cd elongating curling gel the only word that comes to mind when i think of this gel is smooth like this goes on the hair so smooth smell and eh, it's okay look at that it just and it's pretty thick too you know so it's like it's so smooth like ugh. i hope this makes sense like it's just so smooth and it's super moisturizing i like it now i only i used this gel by itself one time like three years ago and it flaked really bad on me i'm like this gel is horrible because i hate flakes and i'm like i'm never using this gel again and then i used it and paired it with style and shine amazing results amazing results amazing results my hair was defined moisturized elongated all of it in one that was my hair so these two was actually my favorite for a long time until i tried it with the cannabis and i like it a little bit better but it's okay it's okay i still i still love this gel i still love this gel so yeah this gel is amazing i've been giving my ratings i totally forgot to give ratings but editing me ed editing me got me okay okay and the final gel that i will be showing you guys that's my favorite is the wetline extreme now i know i know darn it came out with a new product with a new formula i know i haven't gotten it yet i'm still working on this one that is because not a lot of stylers mix with wetline extreme for me it's just really hard for me to find a styler that can pair with this wetline and not flake on me and actually still be moisturizing first of all I tried this gel by itself. The definition, it goes so stupid. It's just really drying, which I wasn't really expecting because it is a gel. With my experience with mixing this gel with stylers, I found that she mixes the best with it. So I tried the Texture ID and the Wet Line and it was not very moisturizing. I didn't really like it, uh, not my favorite. But if you happen to try these two and see that it works for you, then by all means, girl, combo it up and do what you gotta do to make your hair popping. But for me, these two just didn't work out. I'm still looking for products that mix. I tried the Myel Organics leave-in conditioner. So I put the leave-in conditioner on, I was like, what is this, ew. So I didn't even get a chance to like do a full hairstyle with it because i just didn't like how the leave-in felt on my hair it was not it wasn't cute at all so yeah if you happen to find a good styler that can match with this let me know so that we can all be popping together all right so those are all of my favorite 2021 stylers i hope you guys found a product that you are interested in trying if you want me to try them on camera i will definitely do that please comment down below if you want to see it and i know it says it's my favorite stylers and i know favorite usually means one but i just you know pick products that i'm always reaching for on wash day and i have like you know other products these are not the only products that i own but i just find that these are just better than the other ones that I have now but if you want to see some of my least favorite stylers of 2021 please comment down that below and I will definitely do that for you thank you for watching this video please subscribe if you have not already follow me on all my socials and I will see you guys in the next video bye